and we are back. What's up, Hall of Famers? Card Shop Eric here, back live at Hall of Fame Baseball Cards in Arcadia, California, and kicking off episode number 17, if y'all can believe it. Thanks to you guys. Episode number 17 of our Monday Night Personal Break series, where we, in this case tonight, it's just me, no Card Shop Matt tonight, uh, I'm going to be ripping boxes for the YouTube viewers tonight. And we've been doing this uh, basically every Monday night for the last 17 weeks, and it's been a blast. I have a feeling that tonight is going to be a fun night um, because uh, last minute uh, we came across uh, this card right here that we're going to be giving away tonight to a lucky participant. If you buy into a personal break tonight, you get a box. Uh, Anyone who go, anyone who grabs a box tonight is going to go into a little drawing to have uh, to have a chance to win this Carl Yastrzemski original uh, rookie card right here. Uh, I think this is going to be fun. Um, that's a, a very iconic rookie card right there. Uh, $250 high Beckett value on that card. Um, if uh, you're new to this, I'm going to show you real quick how you can jump in. Uh, you can click the link that I'm dropping in the group chat right now. That link is going to take you to our Group Breaks page on our website. Follow me right now. I'll show you on screen. That link is just going to take you right to this page. The top four listings are our current Group Breaks that we have available. By the way, only two spots left in the Topps Throwback Group Break. Only three spots left in the Bowman Chrome. And uh, we'd love to fill out this other Panini Football group break as well as the high-end baseball group break guaranteeing one hit or pack that contains a hit per spot but below that any of these products right here that say personal break in the title like right here this pack of tops triple threads says personal break if you purchase that pack right now tonight not only will you get free shipping but you'll see us rip it open it for you that means on camera and you get to watch right now, and then we lovingly pack up your cards and ship those cards to you for free. So any one of these products that say personal break, as you can see, we got six pages. So don't forget to click through all these pages. You'll probably be able to find something that uh, you're interested in. And we'd love to have you. And then that way, if you buy something tonight, you'll go into a little drawing. At the, at the end of the program tonight, we will randomize this original 1960 tops Carl Yastrzemski rookie card right here. I thought that was pretty cool. Had an extra one hanging around, so I said, you know what? And then Yama, Yama was here, and we were talking about uh, offering these free cards. We did this last week with a Luis Aparicio rookie card from 1956. And Yama's like, why don't we do this uh, every Monday night throughout the holidays? And I said, great idea. So we're going to try to find something uh, to give away for personal breaks every Monday night through Christmas, uh, through the last Monday of the year. Um, just as a, a way to say thanks and a way to give back to everyone who's been supporting us for personal breaks, try to find something neat uh, or interesting or cool or fun to give away uh, to the people that buy into our personal breaks and help keep this series going. Just uh, tis the season for giving already, folks. We're starting early. What can I say? Um, we already got products lined up, uh, but what you see on screen right here is what we got. That's it right now. There's nothing waiting in the wings, so we're going to need you guys to jump in, uh, get some personal break boxes. We'll rip them right now. We'll ship them for free, and then you get a chance at that Yaz rookie. So that's cool. I'm looking at the group chat. I'm seeing uh, everybody popping in. Hello, group chatters. What's up? Just a couple quick shout outs. What's up to Soup? Soup says, love the shirt, by the way. Yes. This is my uh, official Dodger Films uh, Superman Slam Chowder. It's one of my favorite shirts. Um, thanks for being here, Soup. What's up, bud? Uh, bunch of people in here. Bubble Pug, Cam Vet, James, Chris Mania, Mr. Biggs. Bunch of people up in the group chat already. Hope everyone's having a great Monday. I feel like this is a, such a fun way to kick off Monday nights. Uh, Austin Kleschka, Spidey. Is in the group chat right now, too. He's also a group chatter. What's up, Spidey? I'm still alive from the hot sauce challenge. And I'm, that's all I'm going to say about it. Don't worry. But, uh, yes, I'm still here. I've been telling everybody that we did that. That was a lot of fun the other night, buddy. Um, 
Yes, let's get started. Enough talking. Uh, kicking us off in the lineup tonight is Terezo L. Uh, I think Terezo should be watching. We got an email from Terezo earlier making sure that we are going to be going live tonight. And yes, Terezo is first up. Uh, quick shout out to LG for the $1.99 super chat. Says, hello shop, I love your personal breaks. And uh, there's a second one from LG. Hello, shop. I love your personal breaks. So, LG, we appreciate you so much. Uh, thanks for, glad you enjoy the breaks for whatever reason. We'd love to have you jump in if you can. Grab a box. I'd love to open something for you. But either way, thanks for the shout out and thanks for the super chat. Terezo is in the chat, says, hey, shop. Uh, let's get into your box of gold label. Terezo's up first. On deck is Brian L. with a couple boxes of tops, clearly authentic. And then uh, the Chuck Wagon. Uh, batting third with Phoenix football. Nelson P is batting cleanup with four different rips right here. Uh, Nelson P, way to go, buddy. I can't wait to get ripping on all these products. Let's start with Terezo. Terezo, what's up? How's your day been? Hopefully good. This box of tops gold label is for you. And thank you, Terezo, very much for including your YouTube screen name. Right there on the sticker, it says your order number plus your YouTube screen name, so we know exactly who you are in the chat, and we ask that of anybody that's ordering uh, personal break spots or even group break spots, please include your YouTube screen name so that we can properly identify, identify you in the group chat if need be. Just keeps everybody safe in case of a mishap. Terezo, thank you. Let's do this. 2019 Tops Gold Label. Looks like the gold frame car is going to be that one. So that one I'll open last. We'll see what's up. Bubble Pug says, I'm ready for Christmas. Yes, it is. Christmas is fast approaching. All right. Trey Turner here. How's that doing, Trey Turner? World Series champion. Starting it off. Buster Posey. Uh, Cal Ripken Jr., Matt Chapman, and Trevor Bauer, and the first pack is down, and we are off and running, folks. Episode number 17. I can't even, I can't even believe it. Can't believe we've been doing this for 17 weeks, with the exception of the one week that I was at the Industry Summit. Otherwise, I might ask you to trade. Uh, here's another Trey Turner. This is the blue parallel, 7 out of 99. And Javier Baez, uh, Terezo, let us know real quick your favorite team. And uh, if you have a favorite player on that team, drop that in the comments right now for everybody to see. If memory serves me correctly, I think Terezo's in Texas, but I can't. I'm guessing going to be a Texas fan. <clears throat> Freddie Freeman. Roberto Alomar, Ronald Acuna right there. Someone's mentioning that the throwback break is sold out. Well, if it's sold out, that's great. When I uh, started this about eight minutes ago, there were still two spots left. So that's the reason that there's no date yet, because uh, it's sold out in the last 30 seconds, or eight minutes since we've been live. Uh, but we'll put a date on that. Most likely going to go down on Wednesday at 2 p.m. Jose Ramirez here. And Terezo likes Houston, by the way. Sorry about your Astros, I, I guess I should say. Blackman here, Syndergaard, Stanton, and Sanchez. Good news is that uh, we have seen a fair amount of Houston Astros autographs coming out of gold labels. So, hey, maybe I feel like you got a good chance of getting a Houston Astro autograph, but you never know. Here's Torres, Scherzer, Snell. There's Nolan Ryan on the Class 2 Black Parallel. That's a good little start. Bryce Harper. Uh, Dodger Boy is asking about uh, gold label boxes. I believe they are $69.99, right, Yama? $69.99 shipped if you get them for personal breaks. $69.99 free shipping. Uh, Mariano Rivera. Sandy Koufax here. Whit Merrifield on the Black Parallel. Blue Parallel, Stanton, 72 out of 150. Pretty cards. And Chipper Jones there. 
And then I believe this should have your gold autograph in it. Let's see what's going to be going down. All right, Joey Gallo, base card on the back. Ted Williams, base card on the front. There they are. And your gold framed autograph is. Let's see, I'm seeing a ball. I'm seeing St. Louis. So it's not going to be an Astro, unfortunately, Terezo, but hopefully you will at least be happy with a little Jack Flaherty. A little on card auto from my Irish friend, Jack Flaherty. There he is. It's a beautiful, these cards, these gold framed autographs, I can't get enough of them. I want to collect the whole set. I don't even know if that's possible. I definitely probably don't have the budget to do that. But man, these gold framed autographs are amazing. They look so cool with the top's gold label in the in the bottom right corner and the gold like the gold like sparkly gold strip going through the middle of them. And that's a pretty clean autograph. There you go, Terezo. Terezo Luera says nice. So there you go. That's going to be coming to your door, shipped for free. We're going to ship all these cards tomorrow, folks. That's what else is cool about personal breaks. Uh, less sorting. So we don't need to take that extra time to sort cards or whatever. We, but we've been getting them out pretty quick. So we pack them all up tomorrow, get them in the mail, either tomorrow afternoon or uh, first thing on uh, Wednesday. But they ship pretty quick. Thank you, Tereso. Appreciate your uh, participation. And for helping us start off the evening tonight on episode number 17. And you, you didn't know this. You just bought in because, but now you have a chance to win this uh, 1960 Tops Carl Yastrzemski rookie card. And that goes for everybody else. Anybody else who participates by buying a personal break box tonight will go into a randomizer at the end of the video. And we'll, we're going to randomize off this Carl Yastrzemski rookie card to all participants. All right, <clears throat> my voice has been a little froggy the last couple days, so I'm drinking some ginger ale. Disc and kayak fishing says, love that you're doing that giveaway again. Really fun idea. Yeah, man. Kind of last minute, but uh, we, and then we decided earlier that we're going to do it all the way through the holidays. So we're going to do it all this month and all next month, every Monday. We're going to include some kind of a bonus card or Whatever I can find around the shop just to kind of, I don't know, just for fun. Tis the season for giving. All right. Now batting. Brian L. with two boxes of 2019 tops. Clearly authentic. Uh, on deck, Matthew W. with Phoenix Football. Followed by Nelson P., Gold label, a couple of boxes of archives retired, and a pack of tribute. And uh, let's see, uh, James M. got in with, uh, so you're James M., you're one, two, three, I think you're fourth up. You're batting clean up now with some elements, football, and then a couple additional boxes of uh, archives, signature series, retired and active. And then whoever else is coming up tonight, Still time to get your get your uh, orders in for personal breaks. Not sure if Brian L. is watching. Brian L., are you watching? Brian L. usually doesn't watch live, or if he does, he doesn't comment too often. But uh, he does always make sure to leave his YouTube screen name. Thank you, Brian L. 1213. We appreciate you. He's a, kind of a local guy. I think he lives kind of locally. Um, but I'm just going to get ripping because I don't think Brian L's watching. So if you were watching, Brian, I'd give you a choice which box you wanted to rip first. But <clears throat> I'm guessing you're not here. But when you do get to watch this, hopefully you do watch the replay. Uh, thanks, Brian. And check out your boxes. All right. Uh, let's see. Bobby123456 is asking, how do I get in? Uh, I'm going to paste the link right there. There you go, Bobby. Click that link, and uh, it'll take you to our group breaks page. Choose any product that says personal break in the title. 
make that purchase, and we'll open your box on camera tonight. Here you go, Brian. Jose Barrios, black parallel on the uh, 35th anniversary throwback. This is the card where it looks like he's picking his nose if you just glance at it. But that's a nice looking card. I love these little throwbacks. It's numbered 53 out of 75. There we go. And it's a nice uh, on-card autograph. Nose picker. <laughs> yeah, not bad. Not bad. Clearly authentic. So there you go, Brian. Let's see what else is next. Here you go. Three, two, one. Okay. Ooh, yeah. All right. How about Lou Brock? On the top side, uh, 206, I think. Numbered uh, 21 out of 99, signed in the red ink. A little mini parallel right there. That's a sick card. Clearly authentic, was a little bit cooled off last week, but maybe this means it's going to heat back up this week. Maybe we plowed through all the colder cards, and now some cooler stuff might be starting to come out this week. So maybe, maybe some other guys want to jump on some uh, Clearly Authentic this week. Yeah, good start so far. That's a nice looking card, Brian. Whenever you get to see this, I think you should be happy with those couple of boxes, man. That's pretty tight. I love the red hat with the red signature right there. 21 out of 99. Well, well, T206 clear reprint right there. Boom. Really cool. Thanks, Brian. Appreciate your continued support. Thank you very much. Quick sip of the old ginger ale. All right. Is Matthew W. with us? Chuck Wagon. Come in, Chuck Wagon. Are you out there? 10 4, good buddy. <laughs> Matthew W. is a uh, semi truck driver, and quite often he'll uh, jump in uh, to our brakes and then he'll listen while he's on the road. Uh, I'm not sure if he's listening right now. But, Matthew, wherever you are, thanks again for jumping in. Oh, there he is. He says, I'm here but driving. No problem. I'll do all the talking for you. And thanks again for uh, leaving your YouTube screen name with us. Helps me to identify you. Appreciate you, buddy. You got a box of 2019 Panini Phoenix football. Two autographs and one memorabilia card per box. Let's get into it. Who's into football out there in the group chat? Anybody? Sound off on your teams right now. If you got football teams, I'm a Rams fan personally. That's my number one team, of course, in LA. I was a Rams fan since I was a kid. Then they moved to St. Louis, and I kind of lost interest. But now having them back in LA is great. I feel better rooting for them again. All right, uh, Matthew, I'm going to take, uh, I'm going to start with the top pack. Let's see what the top pack has in store, just for fun. <clears throat> mean likes the Raiders, Henry likes the Texans, Corey likes the Panthers, Blake likes the Chiefs. <clears throat> Cam Vett thinks the Rams are winning the wild card, Austin likes the Packers. Disc and Kayak likes the Vikings. Camden likes the Ravens. Max likes the Pats. And I think Chuck Wagon is a Chiefs fan. Isn't that right, Yama? I believe so, yeah. And they always say go Chiefs. Here we go. Eli Manning base card on the front pack. Followed by Lamar Jackson. Followed by a little Mitch Trubisky little insert. QB Vision. Fun looking card. And that one's numbered out of 199. We got an Aaron Rodgers QB Vision base card. And then a Josh Allen rookie. So that's the way that this box of Phoenix is starting off. That was the top pack. Now I'm going to open the, the bottom pack. 
to see if anything was bookended in this box. <clears throat> All right, we got a uh, Corey Davis base card here, a Russell Wilson base card, and a little Panini decoy card. They put in these decoys to keep people from feeling the packs for the thicker cards. Uh, here's a Jamal Adams. Jets, looks like a blue parallel, uh, numbered 4 out of 35. Followed by uh, Travis Kelsey catching fire and Jeffrey Simmons rookie. Uh, I'm going to try to get a pack right in the middle. Let's see. Let's go this one right here. Let's see what this I did a top pack. I did a bottom pack. And I'm just grabbing one out of the, uh, the middle. All right, we got a uh, Chris Carson base card, Leighton Vander Esch base card. Ooh, another Panini decoy in that pack. Uh, Jameis Winston red parallel. That's numbered out of 299. That's a nice looking card. I like the solid red with the red and brown uniform. Uh, followed by uh, David Montgomery adrenaline rush and uh, Paris Campbell rookie card. All right, going from the top of the stack again. Still yet to find your first hit, Matthew. This pack has Aaron Rodgers. It's got Deshaun Watson. It's got Mike Evans catching fire. It's got uh, Andy Isabella rookie card and a red parallel Kyler Murray rookie. That's a nice looking card right there. Red on red on red. Numbered 102 out of 299. That's a nice looking rookie card right there. No Chiefs yet though. Going from the bottom of the stack again. TJ Watt base card. We got uh, Luke Coikley, I'm going to say. After that, then we got... Christian Wilkins, a rookie card that's looking like a parallel. We got some kind of a potential autograph behind him. We also have a Drew Locke base rookie. And let's see if this is our first auto. Benny Snell Jr. autographed rookie. And that's Pittsburgh Steelers. So no KC yet, Matthew, but we're still on the hunt. And by the way, the Christian Wilkins rookie is numbered out of 299. Any any uh, Steelers fans watching right now who like this card? Sound off if you're a Steelers fan. Benny Snell Jr. Nice looking card. So that's your first autograph. Two autos and one relic per box on average. You hope to get the high average all the time. Here's a Dak Prescott base. Quick shout out to Ivan Arroyo. What's up, Ivan, with a, just a little thumbs up. Hey, buddy. Hope you're having a good day. Jerry Hughes here. We've got a uh, Tony Pollard. Looks like a gold parallel, followed by a thick card. We also have a Jerry Tillery rookie card here. And the thick card is Damian Harris. Rookie patch. One, two, three, four. That's a four color patch right there. Rookie with the pats. That's sick. And by the way, the Tony Pollard is numbered nine out of 75. That's a sick looking patch for everybody watching right now. Four breaks in that bad boy. Ivan says, busy, but trying to make time to watch these awesome breaks. Thanks, man. Appreciate you popping in. And this uh, Damian Harris patch card is number three out of ten. So, Matthew, it's no, uh, it's no Chiefs, but uh, hopefully you're happy with that low-numbered patch card from a rookie. 
Still got one more autograph to find for you, bud. Let's see if we can do it. One, two, three, four, five, six packs to go. All right. Eddie Jackson base card. Justin Lane, rookie, gold parallel. Uh, looks gold, but it's not numbered. Uh, Alexander Madison, adrenaline rush. Uh, Mitch Trubisky, QB Vision, and uh, Farrell with the Raiders is a little base rookie. Matt, Matt Stafford here, base card. We got uh, Smith, Smith Schuster. We've got Debo Samuel uh, catching fire. Or if that's a parallel, yeah, that's numbered out of 299. San Francisco's doing pretty well this season, by the way. <laughs> Tony Pollard, speaking of San Francisco. Man, nah, I got two two uh, vintage bottles of Coca-Cola from 1984. Not sure what to do with them. I don't think they're worth a whole ton of money. Just thinking about maybe making a YouTube video of me pounding one of those, chugging a, a Coke bottle from 1984. I don't know if you guys would watch that, but I feel like it would be fun. Something I'd probably watch on YouTube. Here's a Tr Tredavious White base card with uh, Conley. Uh, we got a Lamar Jackson base card. We've got the Lamar Jackson's numbered out of 199. We got Matt Stafford, and we've got uh, Ben Bang Banagoo, rookie. Three packs left for Matthew. Christian McCaffrey on the top of this pack. Joe Flacco as well. Uh, Deontay Johnson, numbered uh, 70 out of 99, followed by Russell Wilson and a little Ed Oliver rookie. All right, Le'Veon Bell here on this. Should have one more hit coming with these two packs. Uh, Chris Jones as well. We've got Tom Brady quarterback vision. Uh, that one's numbered out of 149. We've got Debo Samuel catching fire and uh, Humphrey rookie. So this last, <coughs> excuse me, <coughs> this last pack should have your last autograph unless you got the low average which I hate to see happen, but I hope it doesn't happen. I do see something thick in the middle here. It uh, doesn't seem to be a decoy, so that's a good start. You got uh, Kenny Galladay base on the top, followed by Jimmy Garoppolo base, followed by Corey Davis. Card on the back is uh, Miles Boykin rookie card. And your final hit of the box Noah Fant, it's Broncos, it's not Chiefs, sorry Matthew, but it's a nice old uh, dual relic with an autograph, and it's a rookie card for the Denver Broncos. Let's see if it's numbered at all, it is numbered, 33 out of 50. It's a cool looking card for sure. Any Broncos fans watching live right now? And these uh, swatches are, let me see. I can't tell what they are. I think it's part of the number. I think it's some vinyl from the from the number on the jersey. Just straight vinyl from the number. It's actually kind of cool. It's a beautiful looking card. James M says he's a stud. Terezo says, yeah. I suppose that's to my Broncos question. <clears throat> Mike Campbell, Georgia, Falcons fan, what's up? So, uh, thank you, Matthew, Chuck Wagon. Drive safe out there. 10-4, good buddy. Got some nice hits. No Chiefs yet, though. You and Michael Heron. We're looking for Chiefs for you, and we're looking for Alonzo for him. 
Mahomes for you, Alonzo for him, and so far we've struck out, but having a lot of fun trying, and I, and I hope you're enjoying it, and we appreciate your support, Matthew. Drive safe out there, buddy. All right. Uh, remember, uh, if you want a chance to win this 1960 Tops original Carl Yastrzemski rookie card, this card is going to be given away to one personal break participant tonight. We did this last week. It was a lot of fun. We're going to try to do this every Monday through the end of the year as a little holiday gift. So if you want a chance, if you want to get in the lineup tonight, tonight's a great night. Boston fan or not, Yaz is one of the greatest of all time. And, uh, yeah, purchase any personal break product, get in the lineup, and we're going to randomize this off at the, end of the, at the end of the night. Stay tuned for that. But now batting, Nelson P. Nelson P., thank you for leaving your YouTube screen name, Rec Rap. I think I've seen a couple comments earlier, but you got a pack of tribute with one guaranteed auto or relic. Uh, you got two packs of Archive Signature Series Retired with one guaranteed autograph per box. And you got a box of the gold label with one guaranteed auto. So you got some fun guarantee products here. And then following you is James M. with some Elements Football and some more uh, Archives Signature Series. And then after James M., we got nothing but black holes back here, folks. See where my hand is on the right? Black holes. That can't happen. I'm going to put Yaz in this black hole on the left-hand side. But now's a great time to jump in, folks. You get a chance at that Carl Yastrzemski rookie card, and your boxes will be opened up pretty quick. So get those purchases in. Uh, let's drop those uh, soup, a.k.a. Luis Valdez. Dropping links like bombs. I'm dropping links, too. Click those links. It'll take you to our group breaks page. Choose any product. There's six pages there. Look through them all. Choose any product that says uh, personal break in the title, and you won't have to pay shipping, and we'll open it for you right now. And then we'll ship it to you for free. Uh, Rick Rapp says, I'll take a trout. Uh, which one do you want me to start with? Tribute, archives, or gold label? The choice is yours while I take a sip of ginger ale. Tribute first. All right. Let's do it. Nelson P., thanks for jumping in. Let's see what you got in your pack of tribute. Is it going to be auto or relic? Had a young man uh, come into the shop and pulled a pack today and pulled a uh, Vlad Guerrero Jr. autograph, green parallel. This kid's been hot to trot in the shop. Let's see what we can do here. Got a Duke Snyder. On the front, we've got Luis Severino on the back. These cards are extra thick, too, and they got the cool uh, acetate tops. Cardboard bottoms with glossy. Cardboard in the middle, glossy on the back, acetate on the top. And then your hit. It's going to be right here. I think it's an autograph. It's St. Louis. Hopefully you like St. Louis, Nelson. Woo! Bob Gibson. He's a Hall of Famer. And uh, one of the hardest throwing pitchers of all time right here. This guy was feared on the mound. Excuse me. Nice on-card autograph. Numbered uh, 43 out of 170 from a Hall of Famer, Bob Gibson. Kids, if you don't know that name, go look it up. He was a hound. It's a nice looking card. Clean autograph, too. Absolutely, very clean. Rec Rap says, wow. I like it. Absolutely, man, as you should. Quick sleeve on that to keep the prints off, but that's beauty. Not bad for a little one pack. Uh, what do you want next, gold label or archives? Or I can sandwich them in between. I can do something like this. A little uh, baseball, that's a... It's the equivalent of an ice cream sandwich. That's a baseball card sandwich right there. <clears throat> ah. 
I like the sandwich, he says. All right, let's do it. Quick rip. Archive Signature Series Retired Player Edition. Uh, I think we actually recently reduced the price on these, too. I think they're... I think they're only fifty bucks, forty nine ninety nine. I think on these right now, if I'm if I'm not mistaken, and that's free shipping. So you got a quick rip, one encased, retired player autograph per box. Let's see who you got in your first one, Nelson. Right here, Brad Osmus. Brad Osmus, isn't he the guy that just uh, lost a job with the Angels? Yeah. <laughs> uh, 29 to 37, it's an on-card autograph signed on a Bowman card. Anybody know what year Bowman this is? I don't. It's a, it's a buyback card. I don't remember what year Bowman that is. Anybody? Matthew Denny says 94. Let's see how close you are. Usually this fine print I can't read, but... Matthew Denny nailed it right there is the copyright date at the bottom. 1994 Bowman. Nice job, buddy. Uh, uh, all right, that's your first that's your first of two archives boxes, Nelson. But uh, since we're doing the baseball card sandwich, next we're getting into your box of gold label. And there's your gold framed autograph there. We're going to hit that last as usual. And actually, I'm going to go from the bottom, if you don't mind. I'm going to go from the bottom of this stack right now. Just because. I haven't done that yet. All right, here we go. Ooh, starting off with a Vlad rookie. It's not a bad way to start. Maybe a, hopefully a preview of what's to come. By the way, Nelson, uh, would you mind re remind everybody your favorite team? Favorite baseball team? And uh, if you have a favorite player, you can throw that in too. Here's uh, Tanaka, Hoskins, uh, Austin Riley, Black Parallel Rookie. Oh, there we go. He says Braves, right? As uh, we're looking at this Braves card right here. That's perfect. Uh, Nolan Arenado. Freddie Freeman fan, all right. Mark McGuire here, uh, Carter Kaiboom, J.D. Martinez, uh, Red Parallel, Jose Altuve, four out of 50. Nice looking card there. Uh, there's a nice little Mike Trout card there. Everybody likes the Trout man. Matthew Denny, also a Braves fan. Uh, Luis Severino. Joey Gallo, Jackie Robinson, uh, Griffey Jr. on the uh, Class 1 Black Parallel, and Hideki Matsui. Uh, here is Nolan Arenado. That's Soup's Bay right there. <laughs> Speaking of soup, soups keeps dropping the links to our uh, our uh, group breaks page. Click that link that Luis Valdez is putting into the group chat, and then you can sign up uh, to have us open a box for you tonight on personal breaks. Nolan Arenado, Manny Machado, Tony Gwynn, Roger Clemens, the Class Three Black Parallel, and Ichiro. Texans 49, yes, Ivan is correct. There is free shipping on breaks. Personal breaks and group breaks all have free shipping with us. Ichiro here. Hideki Matsui. Mike Trout. Little Peter Alonzo. Pete Alonzo on the uh, Class 1 Black Parallel Rookie. And Bo Jackson. One more pack, and then we check out your gold friend Otto. Don Mattingly here. 
Bo Jackson, Frank Thomas, Yusei Kikuchi, rookie, black parallel, class two, and Don Mattingly. All right, Nelson, here we go. Here's the pack that contains your gold framed autograph. Let's see who it is. He's hoping for Freddie Freeman or Dale Murphy, it sounds like. Trevor Story, base card on the back. Chris Sale, base card on the front. Trevor Story's a black parallel, by the way. And your gold framed autograph is. I'm guessing pitcher for the Toronto Blue Jays. So you missed Atlanta. Toronto's just north of Atlanta, of course. You missed them just by that much. And you're looking at our boy, SRF. Not Stevie Ray Fawn, but Sean Reed Foley. Gold framed rookie on card autograph. That's a beautiful looking card. I wish I could pull every team that everybody wants. I really do. That's a nice looking card, though. And don't forget, guys, if uh, if you if you happen to get something on group breaks that uh, maybe you don't need for your personal collection, there's usually somebody else out there who does. So uh, you can you can trade. You can join our. We have a trading group on Facebook. Go to Facebook, search HOFBC Trading Group, and request to join. It's free. And it's all ages. Just uh, respect the room, respect the rules, and uh, everybody will get along. We got like 320 people up in there. Well, that's a great place to trade if you're in our community. You know, say uh, Nelson wants to trade this card. He'll take a picture of it when he gets it in the mail. He'll post it in the trading group and say, hey, anybody got something to trade? I'm looking for Freddie Freeman. Some, you know, whoever asks, you know, they'll ask you to put a value on it. Blah, blah, you know how it goes. If you don't, go in there and trade and, and learn a little bit. People are usually pretty cool. People all ages, younger people, older people. So you got to have some patience, but it's a lot of fun. All right, Nelson, you got one more box coming up. And then we move on. Quick rip. The last part of the baseball card sandwich, as it were. All right, Archive Signature Series Retired Player Edition featuring one encased retired player autograph card per box. Your card is... How about a Jose Canseco one of one, huh? Huh? You like that? You like that, buddy? <laughs> Yeah, there you go. You got the only card in the world like it. And this is one of my favorite cards for some reason. I always liked these little 19, what is this, 1989 tops, little like, these little mini cards. Yeah, Major League Leaders. These are fun. Is that 89? I believe so. Yes. 89. It's a great looking back on this card. A lot of cool color and design work. And then just like the frosted edges on this card. And then that one of one just sparkling right under my thumb there with a nice clean on card autograph. A lot of Jose Canseco collectors out there. If you're not into this card, I know somebody will pick that up from you. But I think that's great, man. One of one. Soup says, played against him once. The dude is a monster. Uh, wow. When was that? And what would you play? By the way, did you get my Ace Ventura reference? <laughs> I'm sure you did. That's sick. That's a sick card. All right. Now we're getting somewhere. Now things are starting to heat up, folks. Now might be a good time to jump in. Nelson P., cheers to you. Thanks, buddy. That was fun. Thanks for letting us rip for you. You got a chance to win this uh, Carl Yastrzemski rookie. And you can still jump in later if you want to. No problem. You can jump in as many times as you want per night. It doesn't even matter. Well, we are giving away this Carl Yastrzemski rookie to one participant tonight. So tonight might be a good night to jump in. 
We're going to randomize this card at the end of the break. <laughs> Shout out to to Ivan and uh, Roseanne, who ripped the, the ripped the phone out of his hands to see Jose Canseco. That's funny. Hi, Roseanne. Now I know you got a thing for Jose Canseco. I'll keep my eye out for any cards that might come through. All right. Soup says, softball tournament a few years back, his twin brother was playing too. That's awesome. That's cool. Should get him to play uh, softball with us. I wouldn't mind that. I think I can hit bombs farther than Jose Canseco. Uh. <laughs> All right, now batting, James M. James M. talking about Axel Foley in, in the group chat right now. Beverly Hills Cop reference? What do you want first? Do you want archives? Do you want elements? Do you want a little sandwich? You want an archive sandwich? What do you want, James? You tell me, buddy. Uh, sandwich is fine. I think that's that's what you mean there. And after these three boxes, folks, we got nothing back here. Blackness. We're going to have a whole lot of quiet time. And it's going to be super awkward back here unless people start jumping into these personal breaks to keep this episode going for tonight. I'm going to drop the link. Uh, Luis Valdez just dropped the link. So Soup's dropping links like bombs right now. Way to go, buddy. Click that link, choose any product that says personal breaks in the title. If you don't mind, James, I'm just going to show people the screen real quick. That link will lead you here to our website. The top four products are all group breaks. That is not happening tonight. What's happening tonight is personal breaks. That's basically every other product on all six pages. You can click on six and go to the final page. There's still some Tops Inception quick rips. You get a pack of uh, Bowman Jumbo for 40 bucks. I think that's the least expensive personal break item. The most expensive personal break item is Topps Definitive for 1100 bucks. Who wants to get brave right now? Page number four has some Topps Chrome. We got some basketball products, excuse me, some football products. We got a pack of uh, museum collection. <clears throat> And all these come with free shipping tonight, folks. All these products. How about a box of uh, archives? Free shipping. Or a box of Chronicles? Free shipping. How about a pack of a uh, little mini box of Star Wars cards? Free shipping. A lot of fun stuff to choose from, folks. Something for everybody, I feel like. Some Bowman Chrome. $129.99 shipped on a box of Bowman Chrome right now. You can get the mini box with one guaranteed autograph for $79.99 shipped. So some cool stuff going on there for personal breaks. Oh, and there now the Topps throwback group break is showing sold out right there. So that'll, that'll probably be happening on Wednesday for anybody who is in that break. Join us Wednesday at 2 p.m. I think that's a pretty uh, safe bet. <clears throat> Uh, someone named Lucas is asking if they're up on personals. No, you're not on personals. You are on, right here is your name on screen, and this is for the Topps throwback group date break, group break, which will be going down Wednesday at 2 p.m. You did not sign up for personal breaks. All right, let's get back to James. All right, James, thank you for being patient with me. Uh, let's do this uh, Archives uh, Retired Player Edition for you, buddy. All right. Don't blink. Here it comes. Three, two, one. Boop. Man, that's a great-looking card. 
Gary Matthews. 20 out of 39. I love this card. Third annual collector's edition. Drake's big hitters. Little oddball card. I'm guessing Topps produced this for the, uh, like, Drake's Coffee Cakes. 1983, I think. Gosh, they're so tough to see those nowadays. 1983. Tops for the uh, for the Drake's Bakery. That's kind of fun. Yeah, pretty cool indeed, James. Love all the color on that. I love the oddball cards. I know some Phillies fans would probably love to have this in their collection. Uh, none of which I don't think are in the trading group. I don't even think those couple of guys even do social media. God bless them. But uh, this is a cool looking card, man. I really love these uh, oddball cards. I got a lot of oddball Ricky Henderson cards in my collection. All right, James. Let's continue on. Let's get into some football, and then we'll bookend it with your other archives box. Some elements football. Jason Wento, what's up? He says, let's see some KB Toys cards. That's what I'm talking about. I do like that. I got some Henderson KB Toys cards. Those are great. I remember KB Toys, man. We had a KB Toys in the mall. Those are the best. Yeah. Back in the day. All right. Elements Football. Four cards per box. Two of those will should be autographed, and one should be a memorabilia card on average. Let's see what's up. Should be one pack inside. There it is. There's your pack. Just the lid flips open like this. Alrighty. These are all metal cards. Heavy metal. Alright. The top card is a Sony Michelle. Cards are. Let's let's do this. Let's look at the bottom card because I think that's autographed. Bottom card: Dwayne Haskins, Washington Redskins. Little on-card autographed rookie. That looks really cool in this lighting right now. That metal just reflecting perfectly off the light with the uh, dark background. That looks great. Looks great on my screen. I hope it looks nice on your guys' screens. But it's a nice looking card. Skins, baby. My great uncle used to play for the Skins. All star, he's a Super Bowl champion. He's in the International uh, Softball Fast Pitch Hall of Fame as well. But this is Dwayne Haskins. That's a nice uh, on card rookie right there. James M says, My buddy will love that. Right on. Uh, I'm just going to turn these over. We'll check out your last couple of hits here. We've got. Devin Singletary, rookie neon signs, 48 out of 50, Buffalo Bills. These cards are signed on like a, uh, so obviously the middle of the card is cut out, and then like this little plastic thing is floating above, it's hard to see, but it's like floating above the Bills logo back there. It's really cool looking. These cards are nice. And there was your base card. And then behind Singletary, we've got Hakeem Butler, Elements of Success. Yep, you need a jersey for success in this league, and you also need a football. And there's some elements of both of those things. This is number 23 out of 99 for the Cardinals. Nice looking card. No. Get some quick sleeves on there. So there's your box of elements there, James. I always like the cards that have the piece of the football on them. Or if it's baseball, a piece of the baseball or a piece of the baseball bat. Those are much more fun relics to me than uh, anything else. Let me just take a moment to sleeve up a couple of these cards real quick for you. Just to keep some prints off. There we go. There's your Singletary. Singletary. 
These are Dwayne Haskins rookie. All right, that's it for Elements. And now, James, you got your Archives Signature Series Active Player Edition. Soup likes the bat knobs. Yeah, bat knobs are definitely cool. They have cards that have, like, laces from the player's shoe. James is looking for a one-of-one. One. He's calling his own one-of-one one right now. All right, James, don't blink. One encased buyback autograph card per box from an active MLB player. Let's see who it is. Three, two, one. Bing. How about Eddie Rosario? Three out of 11 from a Bowman Platinum buyback right there. Let's get a little close up on this autograph. Pretty clean looking auto right there. Good player.